Okay, our final speaker is going to be Noura Erekat, and uh, she's with the U.S. Campaign to End Occupation. Brothers and sisters, we're out here today because we're shocked, we're appalled, we're in silence. We have no words to explain how Israel can attack Lebanon so heinously, so violently, so indiscriminately, and without a single word of criticism from our government, where we spend our tax dollars every day. And yet, in light of that, in light of that, although we're shocked right now, there has been an uprising in Palestine for the past five years. Five years of indiscriminate attacks on the Palestinian people. Five years of home demolitions. Five years of cutting people off from their land, of not letting children go to school. Now in Gaza, they say that it's a humanitarian crisis. They say that dairy and animal feed will last another month. They say that because of the cutting off of a generator, that water sanitation cannot be guaranteed. And in light of that, this government passed a resolution that effectively imposed a political and economic embargo on the Palestinian people. That resolution should have been imposed. That embargo should have been imposed. Sanctions should have been imposed on Israel. Woo! On Israel. Yeah. The same way that this nation has historically imposed sanctions, has historically waged divestment campaigns, when our government does not have the sanity to impose them themselves, then who does it? We do. We do. Who does it? We, we do. do. Who does it? We do. Now! Divest now! Divest now! Divest now! 